So police resuming their search for Brian Laundry in a Florida nature reserve. As we learn, Brian's father may now be getting involved. Uh, for more on this, Callahan Walsh is a child advocate of the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children, co-host of In Pursuit with John Walsh. Nice to have you. Good morning. Got a bit of breaking news. We were told Laundry's father was going to join the search. Indeed, he has. According to our reporting in Florida, he went to that preserve or that reserve area on the west coast of Florida. Uh, sir, what do you think is going on right now with that concession to join? Yeah, I don't really know what to make of it. You know, we, we've seen that the laundries are non-trustworthy narrators when it comes to Brian's timeline and some other details around his visit back to Florida. Uh, but his father joining the search, I, I really don't understand what to, what to make of that because is he really out there to help? Is this to try to gain favor in the public as the public has really not looked at them very kindly on, on this? Is this uh, really a, a true effort to look for Brian or is this a way to stifle law enforcement? I really don't know what to make of it. Okay, so you wonder what the FBI has been looking for. They've been in and out of the house several times. Don't know what evidence they have. None of that has been shared with us. Uh, the attorney for Laundry's family released this statement. <laughs> they believe he's in the preserve or some other type of wilderness area if he has left the preserve. Um, so putting out a public plea and getting scrutiny for that is not necessarily uh, in their best interest. Laura Engel sat down with Gabby's family, meanwhile. Remember, Gabby moved to Florida. She lived with them before she took off for uh, that, the van trip across the country. Just give this a listen here. I'm not certain, but I would think that he's in an area like the Appalachian Trail or a campground where he can live off the land because he had those skills. Do you think he's alive? Do you think he's in the country? I do believe he's alive. You know, um, country, I, I, again, I, don't, I, I have no idea. The reason why the trail issue comes up, because there was an eyewitness about a week ago who believes, well, he's convinced, actually, that he saw Brian Laundry. What would you think of that? I'm not surprised. We had tons of tips coming into the In Pursuit hotline uh, regarding the Appalachian Trail and sightings, multiple sightings from different eyewitnesses. And when you have corroborating accounts, you really tend to look into that. And, and so did we. We passed all of those tips and worked with, the, law, with uh, the FBI, including the marshals as well, too. We've got great connections with the marshals. So I know they, you know, law enforcement is, is eyeing that area. The Appalachian Trail is vast and it's remote. Uh, it is the perfect place for him to hide out. However, it could be another red herring, and that's why it's so important to really track down every lead that's coming in, because he could be here in the States, but by now, he could be anywhere. Yeah, do you know if they have looked in that trail yet? They have. They, I know they are actively searching that area. It isn't as an active search as what we're seeing in Florida and as a public of the searches we're seeing in Florida, but I know law enforcement has eyeballs on that area, not only because of the tips that we've provided, but that others have corroborated yeah, as well. What tips did you provide there? Well, our tips are confidential. We always tell people they can remain anonymous and they are confidential, but there have been similar sightings to what we've seen other people come out with, with similar sightings to people that look like Brian in that area and near sightings of him. So, you know, with many people saying the same thing, you know, we get one tip from, you know, Deloitte, it, it's hard to corroborate that. But when you get a lot of tips coming from the same area, something you really need to start looking well, into. Very interesting. Thanks for coming on today and keep us posted, okay? Callahan Walsh, thank, thank you. you for your time.